stay with that. Do you like that? I hope so. Welcome back to Blixia devlog number six. First, when we are scrolling in the game, I feel it's like a little bit boring, so I did add a smooth zooming. So right now when you're zooming in the game, it's gonna be a little bit more smooth, and I feel like that's a great quick fix for the game. Then, if you remember right, if you did look on my other devlog, I did add dialog system, and uh, I have been improved it just a little bit. When you're clicking on the button, uh, it's we can say it's a next, Hello, next, and the at the last dialogue, the uh, it's gonna change the, the bottom to example end. And after that, when we are clicking wizard. end, I did fix that we are gonna cancel, uh, cancel. We're gonna disable the UI before when we we couldn't even click end or anything, the UI just stay there. So now when we're clicking end, the UI gonna close down, the voice acting gonna close instantly if you're clicking end. Uh, before did you, you can click end and yeah, the voice acting still talk and that's not really nice if you don't want to listen for that. So yeah, now the dialogue system working quite good. Uh, yeah, I, I feel like I need to fix the design a little bit more, but we're gonna fix that later. Ah, welcome to my community question. I'm not sure if we're gonna call that. Uh, but uh, I'm gonna ask you, what do you feel like a day and night cycle? I want to have an idea what people are thinking. Example, having implanting day and night cycle in my game. What do you expect if I'm adding that? Uh, you can comment if you want, or you can go into my Discord and, and talk about that. I gonna write in Discord about day and night feature. What do you feel to having uh, that feature in, yeah, Blixia game? And I have something other thing. I have been adding a support page. And first I need to say, you don't need to support me or anything like sending donation or anything like that but I have adding that I gonna have a small page uh, there there I can say thanks to everyone that have donated something and I gonna add it on my videos on the devlogs and of course my other videos like game development videos if I'm doing that so if you want but you don't really need to but if you want to support me uh, with the Blixia game or support my yeah, content creator thing, so it will be very awesome and very kind from you. The first map is Uraski. Uraski, I can give you some small fact what the world gonna look like. It's gonna be a forest, like a very green place. But uh, we don't really know if it's gonna be very green in all place. Uh, that's a secret, but yeah, I can tell you everything is not always nice. But yeah, so Uraski gonna be a very green place with forest and maybe some mountain and water. And of course, and if it's like when we are designing the level, we want to have this smooth terrain place. So we're gonna mix with low poly and smooth terrain. <laughs> Uh, 
and I do feel like I need to change a little bit with the UI. Example equipment and inventory. And that you can see just uh, an idea how the inventory gonna be. But it's not finished. But uh, I did add a clean UI example with the text. Uh, this font I gonna change, but yeah, so you see, it says equipment and it says inventory. And uh, I gonna fix more that we can see level, we gonna see the money we gonna have in the game. But uh, so you understand a little bit how it's gonna be. And of course, you're gonna see the strength, intelligence, dexterity. Uh, but uh, that we're gonna talk about more in the future. And of course I did start adding drag and drop, <laughs> but I can say it's very buggy, you can see. Have a great day and see you next time.